funny story about this video, right? I went out to Brooklyn to cover a completely different event entirely. Our boy Emor does a sip and sketch event like every week where he invites artists from all around the city to, well, all around anywhere if he can reach them to just drink and draw, you know? But I got there far too late because I'm terrible at mass transit. So luckily, him being the ever busy person he is, he had stuff following this. So he took me to this bar and we saw these dudes just tearing it the fuck down. And I, lucky me, I had my camera in my bag and I got an interview with them. So let's just jump right into it. I'd like to do a song of great social and political import. It goes like this. Yo, what's up? You're here with uh, me and your boy, RC Moore, and uh, my man Dwayne Giddens, aka DC of the Cold Press. Is it decent or descent? It's decent, actually. All right. D E A S C E N T. I went to public school. Don't judge myself. <laughs> <laughs> Nonetheless, decent. Uh, just performed that here at Pianos. Just formed a band called the Cold Press. Yes, yes, yes. EP was released before they uh, yes, yes, yes. gathered together. And could you tell us a bit about it? The EP is a concept EP, actually. Seven songs, Brent and I released over the summer. And it's pretty much our take on society in the most extreme form. Two people coming from different walks of life, but having the same similar desire for materialistic things that it gets pushed onto us by society, making you feel like you need the dopest broad or you know the fastest car, the shiniest chain, doing anything and everything to kind of you know obtain that. But in the process of doing all that, we realize that none of this shit matters, and it leads to a road of like self-discovery. So it's pretty much a story being told through like the EP. All right, so can you tell us a bit about? You and Brent, how'd you, how'd you meet? Brent Butler, uh, the lead guitarist and vocalist for The Cold Press. Mm -hmm. I can't believe you guys are a band now. Yeah. It's yeah. like, a, it's, it's official. Really, it's a thing now. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like you guys just started a family. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes, we settled down um, musically. But um, Brent and I met back in 2011, and it was at a show not too far from here, New York and Poets Cafe. Okay. Um, and, we just hit it off, like, you know, we just admire each other's energy, each other's drives, like stage presence, all that. We just clicked. And we just always wanted to work with each other, but we just kept missing each other throughout the years. So finally, Brent started doing this series called Verse of the Week, where he would take other songs from other artists and do his own version of them. Mm -hmm. And one of them we did, and it was pretty successful. We came out with a dope video to it. What was it, it then? Oh, it was show? called Feeling Myself. It was the um, DJ Mustard. Um, Will I Am, Miley Cyrus, and I think French Montana's on it too. That's a weird concept. Yes. <laughs> what? Uh, what? Okay. But, All right. But we did a freestyle to that. Came out pretty good. Well, not pretty good. Being a little bit modest. It was fucking dope. But uh, <laughs> came out really great, and we realized the chemistry that we have with one another. Like it's time for us to do this project because when we first met each other, we weren't where we wanted to be as artists. Mm -hmm. But he started incorporating the guitar. I kind of found my own path as an artist, so we felt like it was the right time. And so. Initially, it started off as a vanity project, like two friends just working together, and as you can see, a year later, years and change later, it's a full band now. Like, you know, so. Hello there! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back. This is a. I am. I am your team, not crash correspondent, William Maskew, A.K.A. the artist E. Moore, the one who likes to travel and do stuff. And this is the fabulous Brent Bauer Butler B3 of. Cold, the Cold Press Band, the cold press, which yes. is, I, I heard was finalized this week. Yeah, we made some decisions. We legitimized Fantastic. business, all right? LLC. What says business? L.L. Bean. Le leather Chucks? That says business. Leather Chucks. Bars. Mm. Executive shit. Yeah. All right, so Brent, could you tell us a bit about the Cold Press and how you guys decided to form this band? No. <laughs> Well, All right, moving on. <laughs> yeah, okay, so the band 
is a bunch of bitches, okay? Let me tell you. They all, they, they think they got talent. Ooh, I played the drums. Big whoop, dude. <laughs> Big whoop. Honestly, I don't like any of them. They all tricked me into doing this shit. It's like a bad bet that I lost, all right? Because, yes, I sing. I dance. I play piano. Okay. Oh, you know, guitar. and these guys, they take advantage of me. <laughs> they trapped me into doing this this thing. That's why it's called the cold press, because they're cold-blooded killers, and they've pressed me into this horrible situation. Oh, bars. Oh, man. That, that sounds intense. Man. It's intense, just like camping. <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, I have a story. You don't go camping with Thank you. We'll be here all week. <laughs> so, all right. Cold press EP. Tell us about the release. Tell us about the videos that have dropped for these particular tracks. Tell us about your relationship with Decent and why you decided to adopt this family. Sure. So, the Cold Press is actually like a concept EP. It's like a rock opera or a rap opera or a hip hop opera. <laughs> <laughs> okay? Uh, my man Will actually designed the cover art because he's amazing and he put the, the jackalope on it, which, you know, for whatever reason, that mythical creature like symbolized something to Decent and I spoke to us. I don't know if it's a combination of the rabbit and deer. Like on the rabbit, he's deer. You give him the horns. I don't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So like you know, um, it, it's a it's a journey to go on. I think lyrically, it was like one of the most challenging things that I've ever put together. Uh, the body of work represents. Uh, there's a story. It's not necessarily autobiographical. It's loosely based on the lives of myself and Decent who met about five years ago at New Eureka's Poets Cafe, like not too far from here. Um, I just like very, very, very much appreciated him. Uh, you know, talent, lyrically, just, uh, you know, a major, major, major proponent of hip hop and just an incredible guy all around. So, you know, as soon as I had the ability, I joined forces with him and we, we started writing this we were going to do sort of like a Watch the Throne type mixtape back and forth and then it, it totally evolved like almost immediately and very organically into this story that unraveled into seven songs um, that, was not that we actually, if I, if I get my way, we'll be turning it into a feature length film um, based on the EP, uh, which might involve a re recording of all the songs with with the full band um, so yeah check it out soundcloud.com slash Brent Button music the cold press music dot com where else should be found Spotify okay is it title on, is it on iTunes? oh iTunes whatever it's on iTunes it's on my tunes <laughs> it's on my space no it's not I gotta work on that <laughs> It's all over the place, man. I mean, if you follow me on the internet, I'm bound to spam you. <laughs> I'm bound to spam you. That's what I do. So, yeah. At Brent Butler Music. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> B3. B3. Brent Butler. Neither here nor there. Here we are, 2016, March. There is a residency Dated. for the Cold Press here at Pianos. And they will be here every Saturday until the end of the month. Y'all niggas should come see it. You should totally take out the word nigga. Because I feel like that might offend my I'm sisters. not going to do that. <laughs> also, <laughs> these niggas tore it down. You should come and see them. Yes. We got a video coming out March 30th called When Wolves Attack. Directed by Flow Vision Medium. Shout out to the big homie Remo for directing that for us. It's featuring a lovely, lovely, lovely Kimba Jones. It's my homegirl, Hable. Um, my <laughs> boys, Lincoln, Saya. And we're here once again for the entire month of March, every Saturday. And we also got a lot of stuff coming up. So make sure you check us out. The Cold Press Music com, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Decent, D E A S C E N T, Brent Butler Music, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You already know the whole deal. Check us out. Send me to the grave without that look. I mean it. I'm here for a reason. I'm zeros repeated. And dreaming the money since he was a fetus. I feed off the feeling of hunger. You see, it's a cycle of death. And I'm popping a wheelie. I really would go break the law. I really don't care anymore. Are you hearing me, God? American apostle, the kingdom of heaven is here in the mall. That jackalope, though. I know. That jackalope was nuts. <laughs>